I think despite debates over immigration policy, um, we need to accept that global citizenship is here to stay. That is that we are a kind of one citizen and we belong to the world. We are moving, economy is deeply intertwined, internet has made it possible for us to work for anyone, anywhere. And therefore, somewhere we need to adopt that mentality in education also and move away from this one side fits all. And it, it doesn't need to be something very theoretical and something uh, something w which has only words. We can even bring it in, down into our subjects and especially in a subject like maths. One of the teachers told me once, you can take any maths unit and change it just a little bit and you can have students start to see it globally. For example, when you're doing geometry, explore geometric art as practiced by artists all over the world. Have an inquiry lesson which questions that ask why geometry? Which culture did geometry originate from and what was the purpose of it? During ratio, which is one of my favorite topics to consider, bring in gender ratio in the world. What is the gender ratio in different parts of the world? Why is it different? Are we same? Are we different? Ask questions like these. Number system would be an amazing way to understand exactly how did number system originate? Why have we come to a number system that says 0, 1, 2, 3 till 9? These are digits which are used. How has civilization led to and helped in building number system as we see today? And so on and so forth. Global mindset can be built in a classroom, in a subject, in a particular lesson by simply connecting that particular concept with some question which is, uh, which, which is relevant to all of us globally. We, we don't really need to do anything more than that because the, the ideas, the examples, the situations already exist all around us. We just need to know how to use them. Thank you so much.